What's the most unusual thing you've ever eaten? I'm usually an adventurous eater and here are two of the more memorable items I've tried and. Yummy Mexican tacos. Who doesn't like tacos? Just look at them and mmmm and. But look closer and closer and what's that filling? Beef? Chicken? Fish? Not quite and it's insects. Three different kinds, actually. The menu in Mexico City promised insectos tacos, and I just had to try them. They arrived like any taco set with tortillas, salsa, guacamole, shredded cheese, and three generous cups of the requested protein. I proceeded to create my first ever grasshopper taco and bit into it and delicious. Nice and crunchy and sort of fun to look at. Next up, the worm taco. Yellowish in color and still floppy despite being deep fried. I bit in hesitantly and it was and truly awful. The thing exploded in my mouth like one of those liquid centered chewing gums. I gagged and after cleansing my palate with copious amounts of water swore off the worms. The ants came last, and were almost as good as the grasshoppers. It felt like eating fried, shredded onions. Apart from the worms, the dish was surprisingly tasty. As a curious side note. I later broke out in a body rash. I suppose I'm allergic to some insects. Who knew? I'm just lucky I wasn't born a bird. Dot years ago, my cousins and I were vacationing in Zimbabwe. We headed down to the outdoor dinner buffet at our hotel and as usual I was nosing around for something unusual. When I see a guy pan frying what obviously looked to me like one of these and. Fried pineapples. Sounded good to me. I enthusiastically ordered some. My younger cousins keenly followed along. Many plates of fried pineapples were ordered and delivered to our table. Cutting it was tougher than any of us had expected. Tasted sort of meaty and chewy too and very odd and just then the manager came by and politely inquired how we liked the special. He went on to explain that not many foreigners try this and. Which is actually the cross section of the tail of this fellow and. Shocked forks clattered on plates as my cousins fled the table to purge what they just had. I didn't care, I kept on eating. Not the worst thing I've eaten but certainly not the best either. However, the experience was hilariously memorable. The world is so wonderfully strange. I can't even imagine what I'll get to try next the heart of a yak at a Tibetan restaurant. It was like tender beef, but with a richer and deeper flavor. And no, it wasn't beating and whole and covered in blood. The organ was thinly sliced and a deep mahogany color, like this. Second is probably a frog leg soup in a Chinese restaurant. The meat had the flavor of tilapia, but the texture of a chicken tendon. The seasoning made it edible. Also on that trip I tried donkey meat in kebab style. The meat was kind of gamey and chewy, and the spices were so strong I couldn't really discern the taste of the donkey itself. And last but not least, sea pineapple. An exotic underwater sea creature eaten raw in Asia. It has the most refreshing, sweet, bursting flavor. 
like if you could condense happiness into a mouthful, or if you could bite into a unicorn, that would be sea pineapple sashimi. My poor stomach has been so traumatized by my travels, lol.